session. Yo, 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 what's up? This is episode number 326 of the Home Room with Smooth podcast, baby. Pop, 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 podcast, okay? Um, anyway, I don't know why I just did that. Anyway, uh, I'm here to talk about Dr. Disrespect, all right? I'm here to talk about it. I'm here to talk about it because Jesus Christ, um, this man, he, he just admitted to it. He, he just straight up was like, yo, yeah, I've been talking to kids. Yeah, I got banned for talking to a kid. What? Sir, <laughs> sir, sir. And, and look, and look, Um, I, I, I'm going to bring his message up on the screen. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to share that. We're going we're gonna to talk about it. We're going to talk about it. My, my whole thing is this. My whole thing is this. All right. All right. My comments that I made in my other video on my YouTube channel, uh, they still stand. All right. They still stand. I think it's without evidence or admission in this case or admission. I don't I don't think it is OK to just walk to just believe things. I don't think and every time somebody something plays out and a person is being guilty, someone's like, huh, oh, I, I told you we should just believe them. Like, no, 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 no. We should still be, it should still be innocent to proven guilty. It should straight up still be innocent to proven guilty. However, however, he just admitted to it. He admitted to his guilt. All right. So look, here's his statement. All right. Let me zoom in just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. All right. All right. Y'all ready? I'm ready. Oh my God. It's a freaking fan. All right. So anyway, uh, with that being said, let's whoo, let's get into it. All right. So the Twitch ban. Hello, I'd like to make a quick statement. Let's cut the FNBS. And as you know, there's no filter with me. I've always been upfront and real with you guys on anything that I can be upfront about. And I'm willing to accept responsibility, which is why I'm here now. First and foremost, I do want to apologize to everyone in my community, as well as those close to me, my team, and everyone at Midnight Society Game Studio. A lot of people have been left in the dark about what happened yesterday with Midnight Society and I, and we made the painful decision collectively to have me step down. Our team is full of incredibly talented and good people that have high career ambitions and families, and I'd never want to jeopardize the culture that we've carefully crafted. Everyone has been wanting to know why I was banned from Twitch, but for reasons outside of my control, I was not allowed to say anything for the last several years. Now that two former Twitch employees have publicly disclosed the accusations, I can tell I can now tell you my side of the story regarding the ban. Were there Twitch whisper messages with an individual minor back in 2017? The answer is yes. Gee. We can just stop here. We can just stop here. We can just stop here. Um like we 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 genuinely could. We could just stop here. Were there real intentions behind these messages? The answer is absolutely not. These were casual, mutual conversations that sometimes lean too much in the direction of being inappropriate, but nothing more. What, what does that even mean, fam? What does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? I've talked to kids, okay? I've, I've, I've had conversations with, with young, young individuals, young people. It's never went this way. It never went that way to where that, the, that was a, that was a, a, a piece of it. So anyway, uh, uh, but nothing. What what is inappropriate, bro? Just tell us what y'all talked about. Just straight up tell us. Just straight up tell us. Just just straight up tell us. What what were y'all talking about? What were y'all talking about, fam? Like for real, for real, for real. You said you want to be upfront and honest, fam. What was said? Uh, nothing illegal happened. No pictures were shared. No crimes were committed. I never even met the individual. I went through a lengthy arbitra arbitration regarding a civil dispute with Twitch, and the case was resolved by settlement. Let me be clear. It was not a criminal case against me, and no criminal charges have ever been brought against me. Okay, so wh what were you what, what were you talking to some random kid about, bro? Inappropriately. What could it possibly have been? Like, come on, fam. 
Now, from a moral standpoint, I absolutely take responsibility. I should have never entertained these conversations to begin with. That's on me. That's on me as an adult, a husband, and a father. Fam, yeah, you should have definitely knew better as all three of those. It should have never happened. I get it. I, I'm not perfect. And I'll own my fucking shit. This was stupid. What? Fam, what are you... What are you talking? What the fuck? Now, with all this said, don't get it fucking mistaken. I've uh, seen all the remarks and labels being thrown around so loosely. Social media is a destruction zone. I'm no. What the fuck? I'm no. I'm no effing pedophile. I'm no. I'm no effing predator or pedophile. Are you kidding me? Anyone who truly knows me, who who knows me, effing knows. I, where I stand, the only reason I'm I'm bleeping is because I got to put this on YouTube later and I don't feel like going through uh the process of like editing it out. I just, I just don't, I just don't, I just don't. And podcasts sound funny when I edit it. Uh, anyway, knows where I stand on those things with those types of people. F that. That's a different level of disgust that I F and hate even hearing about. Don't be labeling me as the worst of the worst with your exaggerations. Get the F out of here with that ish. But I think I've said what I needed to say regarding the ban itself. That's it. That's why Twitch made the decision in 2020. To my team, community, industry friends that have supported me, I apologize. I wish I could have said all this sooner. You guys have always shown me and my family love and support throughout all these years. We love you guys like you can't imagine. I have the fucking best community and circle. And if any of this has made you uncomfortable, I get it. You don't have to support me anymore, but just know you have always been greatly appreciated. But trust me when I say this to all my haters that live and breathe social media with zero real life experiences. I don't give a F about you. <laughs> This dude is pissed. He's mad. He's so mad. Yo, yo, what's up? What's up, man? What's up? What's up? Yeah, dude is so mad. Dude is straight up so mad. He is so mad. Uh, uh, what what else he say? Finally, if you if you're uncomfortable with this entire statement and think I'm a piece of ish, that's fine. But I'm not going. But I'm not effing going anywhere. I'm not the same guy that made the, this mistake all of those years ago. I'm taking an extended vacation with my family, as mentioned on stream, and I'm coming back with a heavy weight off my shoulders. They want me to disappear, yet yeah, effing right. Jesus. Bro, bro, Cat Williams. Cat Williams, what did you do, bro? What's that? This is this is Dr. Disrespect's tweet, okay? This is his lengthy tweet admitting to, you know. Yeah, like you know, like it's crazy. Like it, 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 this is a statement about t tweeting a minor. Well, texting a mi well, Twitch whispering a minor. Uh they're not like us. Yeah, yeah, for real. They're not like us. Dun, 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 dun. Certified lover boy. Certified pedophile. Wah, 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 wah. Um, I got caught before I did anything illegal with a minor. Summed it up for you. There were... What are yeah, EDP. EDP. <laughs> <laughs> bro, bro, it's EDP on me, on me. I'm just, I'm just literally reading these, uh, reading these tweets, man. Me looking at all the tweet edits, all the edits. What, what do y'all mean? What do y'all mean? Looking at all the edits. Now I don't want to view hidden replies. Edit history. Oh God.
th this is this is so crazy. Okay, that's the first edit. What? Okay, and and he and then this one okay then the the this one this one okay this is this one's a lot is so doc getting canceled or what oh yeah he's he's done he's cooked bro he's not coming back fam he's not coming back fam he's done he's done fam he's done fam he's done he's done this this dude's cooked he's cooked oh my god Whew. Um. Yeah, that's that's the full statement. That's it. That's it. That's what he had to say. Um. Here, here's my thing. Here's my thing. Okay. So one. Uh. Like, like I said earlier, like I stand by what I said about like just blanketly believing allegations about people because, like, I, I, I still, I still wholeheartedly do not want that to be a um be a practice where you just you just wake up and you just believe whatever somebody else said however however when somebody when somebody uh admits to doing something like this you have to accept it for what it is and you have to call it for what it is and buddy like i don't do look the language that you're using to kind of like thread the needle like fam it had to be it had to be wildly inappropriate for Twitch to go, you know what? We're gonna take action because Twitch has left a lot of things up and let a lot of things go. What a what a legend we lost. I mean, in the gaming space, sure, 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 sure. But I mean, his legacy is fried, like R. Kelly. His legacy is fried. You know what I'm saying, buddy? Buddy, he he basically, like the comment said, he got caught before he even did anything. Like my thing is, why why were you messaging this minor? Like what why 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 there's no reason for that you got a wife and kids why there's no reason for that none and it being inappropriate as well like, come on bro come on come on like there, there's no there's no right no that's wrong uh, we getting a Kendrick. Yeah, Kendrick. Kendrick is not finna diss Doctor Disrespect. You know what I'm saying? He not finna. He not finna diss Doctor Disrespect too. Although, although I feel like you know what I'm saying the song, the song fits Doctor Disrespect a lot better than it does Drake. Um, at this moment in time, because we have an admission from the shorts that he did indeed do do what people are saying he did. Um, I I just I just. I don't, know, I don't even know where to go with it. Like, bro, bro was really out of pocket. He was really, he was really sitting there just messaging old girl or boy. Like, I don't know what he was into. I don't know what was going on. We still don't know, have real details. Like, he, he, he's owned up to it, but he's trying to like downplay it. Like, fam, don't downplay it. Like, literally tell it for what it is. You know what I'm saying? Then you're trying to attack your haters and go at people. You know what I'm saying? Tell him I'm gonna always be here. I ain't going nowhere. Blah 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 blah. I'm not the same man. Like, like, what was your end goal when messaging that kid? That's what we need to know. We need to know. We need to know. Yeah, for real, for real. Like, we need to know what his end goal was when messaging that kid. That's what I want to know. I want to know what was your end goal when you started messaging that kid. What what was it? Why were y'all being inappropriate? What was it? I've never had an inappropriate com conversation with a minor. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if, like, for example, like, if it's, if it's, like, on some family-ish or on some, you know what I'm saying, like, advice, like, hey, man, you know, I want to, um, you know, I I'm really liking this girl, blah, 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 blah. Like, what should I do? I'm like, well, you know what I'm saying? If y'all getting together like that, you know what I'm saying? You need to go on ahead and, uh, you need to go on and uh you need to go on ahead and whatchamacallit. You need to go on ahead and wrap it up. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I'll I'll give that type of advice. 
You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? If 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 it's my younger cousin and she's like, hey, I'm like, hey, you need to make sure you wrap it up. You know what I'm saying? Have you looked into birth control? Have you did this? Like, I'm I'm giving them like actual advice. You know what I'm saying? You got a lot of followers. Fam, bro, I don't know what the deal is with that follower account, bro. I genuinely don't know. I genuinely don't know. I I don't know what happened there. I don't know what happened there. Like that follower account, that follower account is insane. It's absurd. It's absurd. I, I'm I'm owning that. It's absurd. I don't know what happened. I do not know. I do not know. Um, yeah. Did I get bodied? Yeah, I did. Like, dude, dude bodied me hardcore, bro. I got bodied bad, like real, real bad. Like, I had to put like stricter moderation rules on my chat. Like, you know what I'm saying? And I ain't even wanted to be that way, but like he was botting at like a it was insane. Like it was just a straight up, like how many followers uh, did you have, bro, bro? I was trying, bro. I was on the road to 50. I think I had like 40, bro. I think I had like 40 and I was just trying to grow my platform on Twitch and shoot, man. It just, it just went left. I got fucking bought it. Like, and bro was just being absolutely racist. You know what I'm saying? This other person, they were trying to get me to like, you know what I'm saying? They were trying to like, uh, they were trying to dox me and stuff like, like it was insane. It was nuts. It was nuts stuff. It was nuts stuff. You know, it was nuts. It was nuts. Like I, I ain't want no parts of that. Um, but yeah, man, it, it's just, it's just a crazy world we live in, man. Um, cat, I blame Cat Williams, bro. Bro said this year is gonna be crazy. Uh, congrats on the thirty-two thousand point. <laughs> Oh, that's funny, bro. Hey, that's funny. It's funny to me because I didn't do it. Uh, but at the other end, cancel cancel culture is too harsh, and they don't give second chances. I I I agree. I agree because there's some things people can grow out of. There's some things that are a genuine mistake, you know. You know, and let's let's talk about it. Let's talk about cancel culture, right? Let's talk about it. Like I feel like if somebody misspeaks, right? And somebody misspeaks, and let's just say they have a genuine gaff. I don't think they should be canceled for like saying something the wrong way. You know what I'm saying? Oh, here's a real follow. Hey, I appreciate that. I appreciate that for sure. I appreciate that. I need that. I need that, man. I need that. I need that for sure. I need that. Um, you know, and I, I just feel like I just I just genuinely feel like that if you if you are somebody that says something wrong, right? We can deal with that. If you're somebody that, oh, I made a mistake, I did something wrong. You know what I'm saying? You know, uh we can we can build from we can rebuild from that. Um you can rebuild from somebody like, you know, accidentally hitting somebody or 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 you know getting going crazy and hitting somebody. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like not not saying that violence is okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying like, you know what I'm saying, if you felt threatened I think I think it's okay to like hit somebody back. You know what I'm saying? Uh, now if you go too far in that, that's another discussion. But I think I think there's there's different things where you can you can kind of like forgive somebody. Like people somebody can walk it back. Like for for instance, people talking like, "Oh, fuck Will Smith." Like, no, Will Smith is forgivable. Will Smith is a forgivable situation. Like, look, he had a moment whether whether he uh, you have a challenge for me. What what is the challenge? Um like Will Smith had a moment, you know what I'm saying? I don't think he deserves to be canceled. He just had a moment, bro. Was uh try try saying neat girl as fast as you can. What? Not I'm not doing that right now, bro. I'm not doing that right now. I'm not doing that right now. I'm not doing that right now. Cause I, I know I know it's gonna go somewhere that I don't want it to. I know it's gonna go somewhere that I don't want it to. Um uh I, I like like Will Will Smith again, he's not a scenario where I think some he should be canceled for life and it just should be over for him. I, no, he had a moment. He had a moment. Will Smith, yes, yes, Will Smith does a lot of stupid things. He does a lot, and I, 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 I will own that. That man does a lot of stupid stuff. I don't know if he'll own it, but I'll own it. He does a lot of stupid stuff. However, you know what I'm saying? Like, 
even when um I'm trying to think of another person that people people wanted to cancel. Um Dave Chappelle, people want to cancel Dave Chappelle. I'm like, you you want to cancel him just because you disagree with him? Like, is that what we're doing? Is that is that really what we're doing? Really? Really? This is where you're at? This is what you want to do? This is what you want to talk about? Like, I mean, this is how you want to treat him? You know, like, I don't think so. I don't think so. I disagree with that. You know what I'm saying? Like, you might disagree with somebody and their and their messaging or whatever, but I think um, I don't think I don't think it amounts to you know what I'm saying canceling Dave Chappelle. Maybe just don't listen to him. But we don't need to collectively get him up out of here. He didn't do anything. He just said something you didn't like. That's it. That's all. Uh, still, yeah, yeah. It, Will Will is not leading. Uh, he's not leaving Jada. Will is not leaving Jada. There's no way. There's no way. He's not doing it. He's not doing it because my thing is he'd have to he'd have to give up half of everything, and it just it just ain't worth it. It just ain't worth it. His net worth it far exceeds her. His 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 net value far exceeds hers. Man, dude, dude got the box office bumping. He got the box office back bumping after it been in decline. Do you know how many studios is calling Will Smith right now? They like man, fuck that slap. We need him tomorrow. Bad Boys, Bad Boys, Ride or Die. Bad Boys, Ride or Die was good, too. It was a good movie. It was a good movie. I enjoyed it. Martin Lawrence was funny as... He was funny, boy. Um, So I I, I, I fuck with that. I fuck with that. And I fuck with... um, You know what I'm saying? Like, everything everything Will's been doing. Like, he he had a good... He's having a good redemption arc. Um, I think that... uh, I'm trying to think of something else. Somebody else did. Like, for instance, Chris Brown. Like, people are still like cancel Chris Brown. I'm like, we should probably forgive him now. This it should probably be a done deal. We should probably forgive him now. If the victim has forgave this person, right? And it's not like this person like was with malice, wanted to be like was like really wanting to go after this person. This person did it um regrettably, you know what I'm saying? Regrettably so. I think I think it's a I think it's a moment where you can kind of go okay, and re and rebuild from that. And if they're cool, what do we look like being upset? What do we look like? Who are we? Who are we to be upset? Uh, unpopular opinion. Will Smith's last good movie was Pursuit of Happy. Oh, bro, bro, that's yeah, super unpopular opinion. You might be the only one that has that opinion. That's crazy. Cause man, did you forget seven pounds? Seven pounds was was that was fire. Um, I'm trying to think what else, what else people got going on that um, like people are getting canceled for. Um, uh, who's the last person to get canceled? Who's the last person to get canceled? I don't know because cancel. It's also there's also a thing where cancel culture hasn't really been working. It hasn't really been working. It ain't been sticking. Because people, people keep, I, I think, I think people are abusing the system and people are exhausted. You know what I'm saying? Now you're getting, now you're getting cultural pushback because you're pushing too hard in the, in the other direction. I think you should just naturally let the people that need to be canceled get canceled. Don't push the issue and push the envelope and trying to like blanketly cancel everybody because it's just not going to work. And you create a society where people are afraid to say what they think. And I don't think that's good. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I, I vehemently, I vehemently despise racist. I de- vehemently despise racist. However, you know what I'm saying? Like if if they want to feel that way, like I ain't got. Haley Bailey was canceled. Haley Bailey was canceled for what? When was that? When did that happen? For the Little Mermaid? No, you're kidding me. For the Little Mermaid, they canceled her because her mermaid was black. Like, come on, come on, bro. That's like that's like saying Amandala Hum. Stein. Oh no, Amandala Steinberg. Yo, Shardy, you fine as fuck. You know what I'm saying? But, but you walling for going at the Star Wars fans and making a diss song towards them. You walling. I don't know who in your camp told you that was a good eye fucking deal. But that was absolutely terrible. I seen the video. I can't play it for y'all. 
because she copyright striking everybody that has the video. She's just striking people. Like, it's insane. It's insane. So, like, no. No, I'm not. Mm -mm. I'm not going to show it. I'm not going any any image of it, but it, it does exist. If you want to see it, go on X, go on X, you know, Twitter and um, and just type in Amanda Steinberg this. And you're going to see her dancing and dissing and doing a diss track towards Star Wars fans. And my thing is the Star Wars fans don't have a bad complaint. It's not that your acting sucks. The story is ass. You're a great actress. The story is just ass. Acolyte shouldn't have been made. It literally just um, yeah, it literally just mess it really it literally just messes up the whole Star Wars universe. So Haley Bailey was canceled for let them eat that cake. What? She was canceled for let them eat that cake. What what is that? I don't know. No. What what hold on? Let me see. Let me let me type this in. Let me type this in because this is absurd. This is absurd. Let me see. Uh, I got. I gotta see. I gotta see this. I gotta see this. I'm sorry, Haley Bailey. Eat that. Eat. Eat cake. To baby, they wanted to name me Haley, but my I'm I'm looking it up. I'm not seeing she even did an apology video. Hold on, let me let me see. Let me see. Hold on, I'm trying. I'm trying to find this. Haley Bait, let me see, bro. I'm not. I'm not seeing it anywhere. I'm not seeing it anywhere. On here. Well, at least on this platform. Hold on, let me see. Let me see. I might have to punch it into Google. Because I was trying to get it in a capacity where I could um where I could show it. Bro, I, I I even posted an apology. Bro, can you link it? Can you link it in the chat? Can you link it in the chat? Because I, I literally cannot find this thing that you're talking about. Let me see. Let me see, bro. Bro, I'm gonna look one more place, man, and then I'm done. I'm done with this, bro. Like, I don't, I don't believe, I don't believe she was, bro. Oh, you're talking about somebody else. That's not that's not Haley Bailey. Bro, that's somebody else. That bro, Haley Bailey, that's bro, that's a totally different person. You're talking about this TikToker. Oh man.
Hold on. Yeah, yeah, you're talking about that's a totally different Haley Bailey. Bro, I'm talking about the black one that was the little mermaid, bro. You spelled the name wrong. You spelled the name wrong, bro. The bro, listen, the one you're talking about, her name, her name is spelled like this. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna spell it back to you. This this is different. Yeah, you spell you spell a totally different woman, man. That that's that's Haley Bailey. Hey, no, nah, Haley Bailey. Look, I'm, I'm gonna keep it a band. I'm gonna keep it. A, I'm gonna keep it a band. Like she was being canceled be, because wait, was was that was her thing anti-Semitic or what? Like what, what happened? I know what a lot of you guys want from me right now is answers, and I want nothing more than to give them to you. So hopefully I can answer every question that you have about what happened on Monday night. About a week and a half before the Met Gala, I was contacted by E to see if I had any interest in being a pre-Met Gala how off to go. That's the only way that you get there. I was not. I was not invited by Anna Lintour. I did not hold an actual invitation to the Met Gala. I was involved only as a invited to the Met Gala, so security would have definitely dragged me out. I paid no amount of money to go to the gala because I wasn't invited. Since I was little, I have my life I love yeah, she's never going to the Met Gala. Watch it, like no. Nah, so I, I'm watching the video. I'm watching the video. Um, I I gotta I gotta pull it up in a different format so I can download it. Hold on, let me see. Uh, let me see. L let them eat cake. Let. Them. Yeah, yeah, okay. Bro, what did, what did she do? What did she do? Have people purge it? Yeah. Yeah, like you, you sent me the TikTok apology and all that. Like, could I want I want to get it on the screen, but like it's just not. Mm -hmm. mm. Hold on, this fucking fucking AI thing is constantly shooting me with fucking. Okay. Okay. I think I might be able to pull it up in a capacity where we can, where we can, where we can watch this together. Yep. I sure fucking can. I sure can. I sure can. All right. All right. Uh, Twitter scares me. Twitter scares me. It's a, it's a scary place. Yeah. Twitter's a scary place. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to do this. I'm going to retweet this. I'm pulling up my Twitter now, bro. I'm just trying not to get hit with porn, bro. That's that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to avoid porn. Um, uh, let's see. Um, yeah, yeah. There we go. All right, all right. I got it now. We finna watch this Twitter, bro. Twitter is never safe on me, bro. Twitter is never safe. Twitter is never safe. All right, let's stems. The phrase stems from the French Revolution. Queen Mary, where she's um, although there's no evidence. Let them eat cake. 
Oh, she's insulting people with poverty. Oh, wow. I'm not watching this whole apology. This is. Hey, guys. I know what a lot of you. This guys is are long. Right now is answers, and I want nothing more than to give them to you. So hopefully I can answer every question that you have about what happened on Monday night. About a week and a half before the Met Gala, uh -huh. I was contacted by E to see if I had any interest in being a pre-Met Gala host. There are usually three hotels that celebrities leave from to go to the Met Gala. I was stationed at what's called the Mark. I was People... supposed to do content with celebrities and on air about their departure. Wait, wait, hold on. Hold on. People linked it with Palestine? How? 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 I thought she was just dissing poverty in general. Palestine? What? No. How did that? How did that be? What? What? Seriously? See, nah, nah, bro, nah. Palestine? Yeah. You know what? You know what? They can just go on and cancel her too. Yeah, I'm not listening to this. I'm not listening to this. There's no way. There's no fucking way I'm listening to that. There's no fucking way. I'm not listening to the whole thing. Um, but yeah, uh, the the timing was horrible. It went. Oh, oh, it was that week. Oh fuck yeah yeah she got fucked. She got fucked. She shouldn't have. She shouldn't have did that. She shouldn't have did that. She shouldn't have did that. Um, she shouldn't have did that. Anyway, man. Uh, shoot. Uh, that's that's crazy. That's crazy. Um, I do I do want to stream some more. I do want to stream some more. But um, to to wrap up this this podcast episode, to wrap this up, all right. Doctor disrespect. Stay. Just delete your. Delete that. Delete that account. Just delete your account and go off into the sunset. Delete that account. Delete that account. Go off into the sunset. Go off into the sunset. Don't come back. Ever. 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 Just just don't. Just don't. Just don't. For the sake of everybody to include yourself and your family, just don't. You will never outlive this. I don't care how much you grow. Like You're going to see this in your Twitch comments all the time. You're going to have to ban so many words, bro, and emojis. You're gonna have to just be banned and stuff, bro. You're gonna have to just be banned and stuff. All right. Shoot, man. Anyway, um, like, cause what are you gonna do when somebody get does a voice chat and and uh they pay they pay to do the, the voice thing and it starts playing uh Kanye? Oh shit. Yeah, Con Kanye got fucking super omega level cancel, but he deserved it. He was talking crazy. There will be no Nazi support around me, bro. He talking mad crazy. Talking mad crazy. My thing is, how can you like them and you're not and you're not part of the Aryan Empire? Like you're not white. You don't have blonde hair and blue eyes. You're getting murdered. I'm getting straight murked. Um anyway, yeah, bro. Uh Rona, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, thanks for being here. Thanks for following. And all that. What I'm gonna do is, um, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna get off of uh drift stream so I can wrap up this podcast. And um, oh shoot, hold on. Yeah, I think I think Kanye got crazy after divorce again. Kanye been crazy since his mom died. He just kept he just kept going further and further off the hill. He's been just driving himself straight into insanity. And he has nobody going. Hey, bro, you might need help. Um, but anyway. That's my time. I'm going to get up out of here. I'll be back, Twitch. Um, but for everybody else, like, comment, subscribe. Get up out of here. Peace. <laughs>